Hello everybody, good morning. Today's project is a simple way to decorate a plain towel. So I have here a plain pink towel. This, this towel actually was originally a white towel and I, um, I dyed it um, with this pink color. So I have a video on how to dye a, a towel uh, using washing machine method and so if you are interested on watching that you can look in my um, video and then uh, you can check it out but this pink towel it's pink now it used to be white so I have here a fabric um, you can just go to the fabric store and buy like a one fourth yard fabric that you can use and um, and I will attach it to this towel so what I'm going to do is I'm going to embroider, since I'm going to give this as a gift, I'm going to embroider her name on this fabric and attach it to this towel. Um, I have a separate video on how to embroider name, embroider a name, especially if it's a long name, I have a separate video for that. So if you want to, to uh, know how to do that, you can check my other videos. Okay, so let's get going. So, <clears throat> if you intend to put decoration on on your towel, I suggest to get a towel that has this thing here, um, because you would put the fabric in here, you know. So this is uh, about two inches wide. But if you have a, but if you have a towel that is but you have a towel that is like this and um, it's too small if you just cover this one here I mean if you if you prefer to do that this is probably about an inch or less than an inch if you want to put fabric on there and that's fine but um, if you want to cover the fabric all the way up here what I suggest that you would do is trim this one here so because so that it won't be when you put the fabric it would be flat so what I, I did was, um, like, I'm trimming this one here. You trim it so that it would be pretty flat when you put the fabric over, okay? So the next thing after you um, embroider the name, so the way to attach it is first you would measure. So I measured that this is... In, based on my towel this is two inches and um, the, the easiest way is to fold it fold the fabric that way and then measure two inches of here from here that way and then iron it um, you want to iron the fabric so it'd be easier not only to cut but easier when you sew and so now I'm ready to cut I measured from here to here is 29 inches and I have a, uh, a half an inch you could have a half an inch allowance okay so over here I'm ready to cut this I'm leaving one fourth allowance on the top and on the bottom okay Now on the bottom, you would do the same thing. You would want to leave one fourth inch allowance. So what I did that was you I pinned the top on here because um, you don't necessarily w um, need to glue this but I just happen to have a stretchable flexible stretchable fabric glue 
and I want to reinforce it since towels, you know, you always wash it a lot of times. So I want to reinforce it so that it won't come off. So I'm going to glue, put a glue on here. But the trick is you don't want to put a lot of this on here because it will make the fabric stiff. So it's just a little bit. Okay. So. I'm going to put a glue here. See, this is that's how I the amount of glue that I'm putting it's just very light flip this over and then you can pin it or what I usually what I do is just uh, put something heavy on it okay so Now I also did the other side, see? I did. Now we are ready to sew the fabric. So I put the fabric at the other side of the towel. So I'm going to sew this and make sure that the other side, um, it goes through, the other side will be sewn at the same time, okay? So here it is, finished. So we're done with that side, and we also did the other side. Okay.